book some the college middle class yeah, that has they the money, yeah. but, but but the majority the of the people they do not benefit the majority of the exactly. people will benefit from keeping their forest mm. alive mm. because that's where they they they, 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 they go and fetch uh, some plants some trees they, they 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 learn there's a lot of things going on there that's what they would benefit if we don't destroy the environment directly that's where the money should go but not mm. not in into a project that will dig like some uh, 300 meters deep down oil inside a lake that is in one of the most diverse bio, bio uh, environments. Exactly, that's it. Mm. Even if you go to those deep villages yes. and you ask someone, choose uh, between agriculture and oil, mm. what will she take? Exactly. Obviously agriculture. Mm. Because she's knowing she's not going to benefit from this oil company. Yeah. But then if you take agriculture and you compare and you consult on you put much effort on it, mm. we are going to benefit. Yeah. Even Ugandans know it better that with agriculture, we are at par. If you conserve that environment, instead of putting oil companies with not this and this, we are not, you are not going to protect that environment that is going to protect you, to help you to go in agriculture. Okay. And uh, why should we even stick just near this oil, co this oil when we have many things to do? If we go in agriculture, let's protect our forest, mm. let's protect this instead of this little thing mm. that is going to benefit other people even mm. at, to the bigger percentage, not, yeah. to, not to us.